Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to install a tritium tube in your flashlight. And this is for flashlights that already have a slot. As you can see here, that's my Raylight Pineapple Mini. I've had this for, I don't know, about six to eight months. Um, and you can't really see these glow in the dark, but these are a few, uh, there's a couple of keychains here, but these are the individual tubes. And you see here, this one fits right in there. The tube is six millimeters by 1.5 millimeters. So that fits directly into the Rare Light Pineapple Mini, but as you can see, it doesn't hold it, it drops out. So uh, what I've done is that I've bought myself uh, some different glues and I've got this stuff here, which is UV glue. And what's this one called? It's called UV Loca Glue TP2500. This is stuff I've seen uh, people use before. And uh, it's kind of also people use them for screen protectors, those glass screen protectors and to attach them to the to your phone and this is stuff i just bought before it's some um, clear glue basically gorilla and i was actually trying to look for the e6000 glue but there wasn't any in stock so i had to go for this stuff which looks pretty similar hopefully um yeah hopefully it does the trick so basically what i'm going to do just going to open up and i've already cracked it open before. I've got a needle here and I'm just going to slowly put some of this glue into the slot um, here. Okay. Just sort of sp spread it around on the inside of the slot. All right. Um, probably a bit more. Just keep coming through. That. Uh, okay. So it's enough in there. All right. I think that should do the trick. Maybe a little teeny bit more. Can always wipe the excess away. Um, it's already kind of starting to dry a little bit, which is interesting. Okay, so probably before it before it dries, I'm gonna quickly drop it in. So here's the tube. I think that's a yellow one. And uh, let's just put it straight in there. Okay, there it is. Okay. And uh, just like push it in with the needle all the way. Okay, and um, just wipe away the excess. Got so much on there, put too much on, I think. Okay, and that is pretty much it. So I'll leave this off to dry, but uh, yeah, pretty simple to do. And I'll repeat this with a few other of my flashlights as well. Let's see if I can even perhaps make a slot for some of them. So I just wanted to show you what I've done with the UV cured glue. So this is the stuff I was showing you before. The, what did it say? Cooster UV Loca glue. TP2500, uh, TP2500 it says here, and I have one of these torches uh, from a while back, it's a tank 007 UV330, 365 nanometers, I believe it is, so it's less sort of blue purple light, and uh, yeah, I managed to attach one of my tritium vials here in the end, I basically just uh, squirted a bit of that glue out on a piece of plastic and then used a needle to pick up the glue and slowly just add it here uh, underneath the bezel, uh, not the bezel, sorry, underneath the, the back of the tail cap and put the tritium vial there. I left it like that and just turned the, um, the UV light on and eventually it cured. So apparently it only takes three minutes to cure if you put it outside and direct sunlight you know i just had this in the cupboard and uh, turned it on 
seems to be holding quite well. I've tried to move it around and flick it around, um, and yeah, no issues at all. One thing I do notice with this glue, though, is that it seems to be picking up a bit of dust or something like that. So the glue is not sticky itself. It's definitely cured. I left the torch on the UV light on there for some time, but uh, look, it does the trick. If you don't have a yeah, if you don't have any slots in there, you can of course drill one in yourself. I'm not quite sure how to do it. You know, making it neat. Of course, I could probably do a, a dodgy job of it, but that's it. If you found this video helpful, make sure you click the like button. It helps me get it out to more people. And if you want to see more, make sure you subscribe.